Welcome to the Museum of Artifacts That Made America and the controversial story of the Betsy Ross flag. In 1776, British colonists in North America signed the Declaration of Independence and so began a revolutionary war to free themselves from monarchical British rule. They wanted to establish a new independent democracy, the United States of America, and wanted a symbol to fight for. So, as legend has it, founding father George Washington strolled into the shop of Philadelphia upholsterer Betsy Ross and commissioned her for the job. What became known as the Betsy Ross flag was made up of 13 stripes, red for valor and white for purity, and 13 stars on a field of blue, representing vigilance, perseverance, and justice. In 1777, it was adopted by the 13 colonies fighting for freedom as the United States' first official flag. But not everyone in America was free. That's why today the Betsy Ross flag remains controversial. It's embraced as a symbol of patriotism by some white supremacist groups and rejected by some members of the black community because it represents an era when slavery was widespread. In 2019, when Nike launched sneakers featuring the flag to celebrate Independence Day, People like NFL star and Black Lives Matter activist Colin Kaepernick refused to endorse them, and Nike withdrew them from the market. So what do you think? Should symbols be studied as part of history? Should they be used to advertise goods? And why does the meaning of an artifact or symbol change over time?